Thanks to increased awareness and the development of new therapies, a majority of patients recover from malaria when treated properly. However, a growing body of evidence suggests that malaria may continue to inflict damage even after the parasite has been cleared from the body. In malaria endemic regions, recent studies have reported high incidence of young children experiencing stunted growth after recovering from malaria, regardless of nutritional habits. In an effort to better understand malaria's hidden long-term complications, a new study in science immunology has investigated the aftermath of malaria infection in mice, discovering a direct link between bone loss and the accumulation of plasmodium byproduct or leftover waste from the malaria parasite. The researchers observed that when mice were infected by plasmodium parasites, the parasite's byproducts were released into the bone marrow, where they provoked strong inflammatory responses and bone depletion, indicated in white and blue arrows, even after infection was resolved. Interestingly, treating the mice with alpha-calcidol, a derivative of vitamin D3, suppressed these harmful malaria-induced inflammatory responses and prevented bone depletion, revealing a potential therapeutic candidate for preventing bone loss following malaria infection.